thickest thing and the river comes into view. Another old weathered boardwalk over this complicated meadow that gives way to sea at some point. Old elaborate marsh. Oh, there's that witchity witchity. Yep. We came from this direction through this clearing and you can see just beyond where the trail to the Fox Hill observation platform lies. And it's over this way that you'll find the parking lot. So here we have and other things <laughs> There's our Mr. Witchity Witchity. And now we're moving towards a river. Oh, it looks like it's a tidal thing too, because you can oh, see yeah. seeps of water in the marshes. Foamy scum, I always say. It's just foamy scum. Love that foamy scum. Reminds me of the mercy. But there is a river. So many mosquitoes, it's hog heaven for them. So much, yeah. And, uh, you know, a swamp, a red maple swamp, cedar so maple, whatever it is. Yeah. Red maple swamp all over the place. It's so much, yeah. You would expect it to be. And so it is.
here's the river. There seems to be all manner of little fishish things. I can't quite tell what. They can sense the vibration. It's a really great spot. This is kind of an oxbow loop. And the observation platform on Fox Hill is back that way. Here we have this utterly charming bridge which ties into the main trunk trail I've explored before. And now, having hogged yet another fine timber seat, We'll finish off this oxbow loop and make a triumphant final course through the Daniel Webster Sanctuary on Sodom. Witchity, witchity, all the way home. Oh, there's a bunch of blackberry. So that'll make a whole other crazy and dense we'll habitat. It's a blackberry patch. It's a blackberry patch. It sure enough it is. Yeah, those are probably old. Those are probably old legacy orchard trees from the Webster Farm era. Still plenty of color. In the flowering trees, it's almost gone north of here. That's odd. The mosquitoes are kind of, you can tell they're new hatchlings. They're fairly easy to swat.